a season with the book bag. Rat tag got a little kickback. Hunters on hunters got a good batch. You ain't never ever get your bitch back. 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 Let me get it though, but I left style. Let the fuck around, got a nigga pissed off. What's happening, dude? What's happening, everybody? Stay, I got Ranger. He back in the building one time for my fellow members of, uh, you know, Range Gang. I was trying, what was I finna say? I don't even know. But look, you know, I'm back with some more videos, dude. Coming back live in action, strong on some healthy, beneficial type channel stuff. You feel me? I don't know what I'm saying, dude. It's like that. It's about to be one o'clock, dude. And uh, look, just chilling. Gonna do a video for y'all, man. One o'clock at midnight, you know, the grind never stopped, man. It's been a while since I put out a video, uh, feel like to me, because I've been busy with life, man. Life is just life, dude. You gotta put it over everything, man. Interrupts with my schedule on YouTube, but we all good. I'm trying to come back stronger with videos, like I said. So, today, with that being said, therefore, we're gonna furthermore go on into this video that we doing, dude. We gonna do it. We gonna <laughs> dribble guy, man. I'm on my point four for you guys. If you guys don't know, this is the first ever player. That I created my 6.8 small 4.4. I want to show you guys how to be a dribble guy. Now, you may think you went on your point four. You got a stretch big and you got an athletic finisher. Tell me why you went on your point four to do this. Well, you guys may think like, okay, playmakers and point fours, of course, are gonna have the best ball handling, and of course, be the only ones that are allowed to be some type of dribble guy. You know, type of character. But no, you can do this with any single character dude you could do this with any single archetype dude you could be a stretch big you could be a slasher you could be a lockdown defender and be breaking ankles thousand times better than having hall of fame ankle breaker or any type of ankle breaker badge in general you don't need ankle breaker to be a dribble guy dude so i'm gonna show you guys you can use any character you could use a stretch big and have the greatest animations man so that's what I'm doing today, but I'm just on my point four because I want to show you guys the speed that he has. He may have, he's going to have more speed than I would have on a power four stretch big that I have or a center athletic finisher that I have. So I'm only, that's really the only reason why I am on this player. So all you need, you can have any player you want. All you really need to do is have it on absolute for your uh, controller setting. So we're going to go over to controller setting if you guys don't know how to do this. You see what we got our pro stick orientation and off ball freelance mode on. It's absolute. It may be on camera relative depending on what you have it on, but make sure you change that to absolute. Go ahead and save that, and then we on the way, man. We on the way to doing... Somebody's not checking me. But we on the way to doing what we doing best, man. We gonna be a dribble guy out here. So point four, he gonna do it. You know, I'm gonna go over to my left corner. I'm gonna show y'all my hot spot. I'm gonna FaceTime with my girlfriend, okay? She just woke up, and she just took a deep breath. Don't mind her if she heard that. But look, we finna, we in our hot spot in the corner, and we finna do our job. No, we finna hit up our job. Oh shit, he's going crazy. He may lose the ball a little bit, dude. I'm sorry, dude. She interrupted me a little bit. She over here snoring. Okay, we, anyways. We, he, oh shit. He, he may be losing the ball a little bit, but that's all good. That's all cool and chill and whatnot. He losing the ball a little bit, but that's the that's the thing that you want to be a dribble guy. So we just flicking the right stick around a little bit. This is actually warming him up. So this is my hot spot over here in the corner where I'll be breaking ankles. You feel me, cuz? You feel me, dog? So now we're going to go to the top of the key. You feel me? Move around a little bit. Hit the right stick uh, back a few times. Man, he going to lose the ball again. He going to run, run off. He going to run off like that, dude. He going to run off and get him a speed boost. And um, look, let's drop the ball a little bit. I want to chat with you guys. Let me go over here in this cooler because I haven't been. I don't usually sit on this cooler, but I want to go over here to sit down, chat with you guys, give a little brief discussion with you guys. So, look. Don't y'all miss when it was just 2K14 days when we didn't have to do speed boosts. We didn't have to do cheese dribble moves. And there was never a video saying how to be a dribble guy. We were just using the animation dribble moves that the game gave us. And we were doing perfectly fine with it, just doing normal plays with it. Don't y'all miss them 2K14 days going into the park where there was no park scenes? Don't y'all just miss the 2K14 days where there was no type of speed boosting whatsoever? If y'all came to this video to get information on how to be a dribble guy, there's no such thing as being a dribble guy. Why don't you just do your own thing? Quit following these little fake leaders 
fake, fake leaders like Hank the Tank teaching y'all how to do these cheese dribble moves, teleport, step back things. Like, dude, come on, man. Y'all need to get out y'all little sick minds and quit following these people that's throwing up videos telling y'all how to be a dribble guy. Yeah, I clickbaited y'all. I clickbaited the haters. If you a real lover of my channel, y'all really gonna, you know, keep supporting me. Y'all really gonna keep on dropping likes and whatnot. Look, there ain't no such thing as a dribble guy, dude. If you a playmaker, you a playmaker, and you belong, the ball belongs in your hand. That's all I'm gonna say. And you're going to do your dribble moves that you need to do. You don't need to do all this cheesing, speed boosting, step back, times five every time you get the ball and whatnot. You don't need to do all that. Just do one single play to get the ball in the hoop, man. That's all you got to do. So, look, with that being said, I'm going to leave y'all off with this video, man. That's all the brief discussion. That's really what I wanted to tell y'all. Like, shut up with all that dribble guy stuff. Shit. Fuck. Making me mad. So, I'm finna head on out of here, man. It's that guy range. You know, nice, nice time coming back to you guys, but y'all really pissing me off, dude, with all this Jibble Guy tutorial video. Like, there's no such thing. Now, I'm finna run over here to my couch, sit down, and watch some good old Zoe 101. So, look, I'm finna head out of here. It's that guy range in the building one time, man. I'm finna leave out. Look, I'm dipping. It's that guy range. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed and definitely learned a little thing from it. You gotta learn something from it, dude. So look, I'm finna head out of here. It's that guy range again. Hey, 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 hey. What am I doing, dude? I'm sorry. I'm totally sorry, dude.